All right, guys, so we've been putting in a little bit of work here on the arm wrestling table, playing around, and now we're gonna go through some rehab work. Mm -hmm. So this is different than the max effort type of work and yeah. the big lifts and different from table time. So this is something I feel like that's super important. It is. This is, this is um, really to do a lot with arm health. Like when you start to focus on arm wrestling a lot, uh, you know, you're, you're working on the same pieces a lot more and yeah. there's a high chance you're going to run into connective tissue strains. Okay, so you have to do extra for your connective tissues. Okay, so you got to pump, you got to pump fluid through the connective tissue. Got it. So you got to move. Okay. okay. You don't want to do so much that you get like all burning and like turn into an endurance athlete but you gotta get blood through the tissues. Okay. Okay. So the objective of this is to get that blood. Just to pump. Okay. Yeah, this is just getting a pump. Uh, and it, it's, gonna, it's gonna give you conditioning as well, but you know, the main thing is to heal. To heal your connective tissues. Got it. Yeah. So how many, how many exercises are we gonna do? What's normal, like, what's the plan? So you could do all these exercises all together, but I think for you, I think, We'll break them into three pieces. Okay. We'll do a, a cupping routine. All right. We'll do a, a rising routine, and we will do a press and grip routine. Okay. Okay. So the first one we'll do is cupping. Okay. Got it. So super simple. We'll work with a multi spinner. Okay. All right. I'll do a high wrap. Okay. And I'm gonna wrap it. Okay. Wrap. And I'm gonna feel around, okay? Nice and long motion, okay? I can move my shoulder a bit, move it around, all right? And I'm typically gonna work around 30 to 50, okay? But it doesn't really matter, okay? I don't want you to really count so much. Feel, feel, okay? Starts to, this is really lightweight, but okay, that's probably good because I start to get warm, okay? okay. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna do the same thing you with my left. It. Okay, I'll do the same thing with my left, okay? Same thing, okay, let's just pretend I did an equivalent amount. Got it. Okay, I'll go right back to my right. At this time, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go low, okay? Okay. Okay, low grip. Okay, same thing. Really get a lot of movement through the wrist pieces longer than I normally do when I'm lifting a lot longer range than when I'm normally lifting, okay? Play around. Get so in you're there. just kind of feeling out the position here. Feeling it out, okay. spreading it around. I do that same wrap with my left. Oh, I walk hard. up, I drop the pin down one. Okay. Repeat. We'll do that five rounds. Got it. Ish. So are you are you necessarily counting the reps or you're more I, for a feel? It's more for feel because okay. typically you're gonna work 30, 50. Okay. Somewhere in there, okay? Lots of motion, okay? If you do that right left, low, low, like high, high, low, low, increase the weight, no time, right okay. back to it, high, high, low, low, five, five sets, okay. six sets, you're going to have a fantastic pump. Oh, I bet. Fantastic. Yeah. Let me feel. Let me yeah. Feel. Why don't we do, why don't we do a, a couple? Okay. Yeah. So with this, I'm going to yep. wrap here, right? And then you can go low. Let's start off with high. Okay. Okay. Tuck that thumb in. Beautiful. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. You can and push then, the thumb right underneath. See, this is a bit too open. I want you to be like, I want you to have this more close. See that angle? Yep. Okay, that's better. Yes, that's what I like. Good. Slow it down, slow it down. That's it. Like, contract it as far as you can. Now, and now with the body, feel it from your hip, okay? Nice. Good. Yes, yeah, change the angle around a little bit. Nice, nice, very good. Lean, lean, good, yes, yeah. Square it up a little bit, yeah, good. Okay. Yep, yeah, I'm just, you know, we'll move around, isolate this part, this got part, it. yeah, perfect. Go high again. You got it, perfect. Nice and tight with the hand. Good. Yes. Nice and slow. Yeah. Sounds Make good. this tighter. See how your the angle is is too open. Close it up. That's it. 
yeah, there. Better, better. The tighter you can make this angle, the better, okay? Like if you can be like almost 90 with that finger. So this Close here. it up nice and tight. That's much better. That's much better. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, really smooth it out. Really feel the full motion. Good. Yes, close. Close and open. That's it. Feel the balance of it. Go nice and smooth and slow. That's it. Nice. Yeah. Smooth and slow. That's it. Nice. Good. Yes. Very good. Very good. Feel your hips. So then you would go to... Yeah. Now low. Exactly. So with this angle, when you're saying... That's the better. Angle, this is better? That's better, yeah. You want to have it nice and tight. Like squish it down. Yeah. So really shove the thumb Perfect. underneath there. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah. You want tightness in everything. Like you want tightness in your finger joints. Yeah. And you want tightness in your wrist, in your elbow. Feel so it's gonna really slip, deep. it's gonna slip under there. So be careful, you gotta pull it down. That's it. Yeah. Doesn't matter if that's, that's wrapped better. In that's okay. better. Yep, nice. Yep. Good. Perfect. Perfect. So it's kind of a good, not really, I wouldn't say burn, but just, no. you know, get it, get it kind of rolling. Just before the burn. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. And now have it really come up more. Have it like come up here. Got it. Now, there you go. Okay. There you go. Like this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So back. See how this is kind of angled a little bit? I would much rather that somehow you get it like this. Okay. Yes. Like that. And I don't care if it hits your finger like that. That's fine. Yeah. Good. Good. It's so if weird. You can like kind of like scoop a little bit. That's it. Yes. Bring your shoulder in a little bit. Like bring your shoulder in. Yeah. Mm hmm. Good. Nice. Yeah. You so you to... just, you would go and then what would you jump up? Just one pin each hole? That's probably even a bit much, but yeah. Okay. Yeah. I, when I do it at home, I'm going like Or you I, set a weight and just go. No, I'll add. So just I'll, a little bit. Yeah. But I've got like a different loading system. Okay. So I'll only add like a pound and a quarter, two and a quarter. So this will jump up a little bit more than A little that. bit more. Okay. But that's okay. But yeah. like if you can, if you can have like a small, like I'd maybe just put the pin in yeah. and then go up one. Got it. Yeah. But I like, like it. I'd go up like... So five, six sets, yeah, five, 30 six to sets. 50. 30 to 50. Got it. Yeah. I'm just feeling different angles. Uh -huh. there. Cupping high, low, high, low. High, low, high, low, high, low. Got it. That, and, that's, and that's a great way to finish whatever you're doing. So now your forearm's flush. Okay. So you would do maximal lifts potentially. Yeah. Then jump into this. I would. Got it. Yeah. And now for me, you're saying maybe just do this and then that's it. Yeah. And, and split and you, it up in yeah, a different... Yeah. You could for sure. And like... And you, look, I'm, I don't want to tell you, like really what I want you to take from this is the position, the position, got it. the exercises, uh, the idea that there's heavy lifting and then there's, there's strength and then there's connective tissue maintenance. Got it. Okay. The way you kind of solve that. Uh, that's yeah. <laughs> yeah. I like it. Yeah. No, you give, it's like you give me the piece of the puzzle and then my job is to put it together. Yeah. yeah. I like that. Yeah. So what is this, what else would we do here then? Like if you were to do more mm -hmm. than the cupping. Okay. So we'd finish, yep. let's just say we did the five sure. or six. Yeah. So let's do a rising one. So exactly the same concept, okay? We're gonna do exact, a very similar concept. Okay. Uh, lower this just a tip, just a tad. And you can, all these angles, you can play with them. Okay? Got it. But I say this is probably pretty good for what we're gonna do now. Okay, I'll do it again to start. Okay. Okay. So same idea for rep ranges and all that. Uh, why don't we start off with supination, okay? So here we are. All right, I'll supinate. So you're looking for a pretty small range of motion. Yeah, right? Just... I can open it up a bit more. But okay. listen, when I'm lifting heavy, I'm like, Ding! that's it. Yeah. Like, oh, this is barely, yeah. that's my range of motion. Yeah. So when I'm like actually moving them, and for me, this is a bit heavier than I would like to do for supination rehab. Just okay. a little bit. Got it. You know, but I can open it up, move through it, open it, 
this is a nice full range of motion for the supination. And this is this is how you do inside pulling. This is re-gripping pressure. It's really, really good. Okay, so from there, I'll do the same thing with the left. Okay, okay, same thing. Okay, supination, 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 supination. Okay, move to, we'll go to rise. Okay, I'll do this one. Okay, rising. So a lot more motion. Sure. Right? Than the single lift, for sure. Right, yeah. a lot more motion, you know, and really like, this is all about pump, okay. right? It's all about blood flow, okay? Not super hard. You don't want to go till you're deep in the burn. Feel it, get your head in there. If you have any sore spot, you kind of want to work with it a bit. Okay, so kind of seek out where you might be a touch sore. Mm -hmm. All right. Yep. Same thing, left-handed, okay? Same thing. Go over to the right. So we're going to do three. Right, so okay. these are all kind of risings. Okay. Right, so you got the supinating rise, the straight rise, and pronation, which is, you know, you're still pulling up, so they're all kind of similar motions. All right, so supination first. Yeah. So that... Now you, and again, you don't have to do it first. Yeah. That's pronation, but that's fine. We can start there. No, so show, me how to, show me how yeah. to... Yeah, to put your thumb through there. That's it. Yeah, now wrap it and grab it. No, no, not yet. There you go. I grab all that. Yes. Okay. So this would yeah. be in here. Mm -hmm. Now mm -hmm. supination. Perfect. Yeah. Now you can start, like, feel your elbow. What if you pump your elbow a little bit to the left? Yeah. Let it really slide and then slide it. Yes. Yeah. So really big range of motion. You can do a bigger range. You can do a bit bigger when you're doing rehab and blood. Yeah, try and close it a bit more. Try and see, how much can you see your palm? Yes, yeah, good, good. Yeah, close, make that, that you see your palm as much as you can. Good. Yeah, very good, very good. Yeah, put the weight off your left foot a little bit when you go, right? Bang. Bang, bang, yes, good, good, good. Edge it inside your body, yes, good. Close yeah, you it. Begin to, yeah. You certainly begin to feel that yeah. as you go. Mm -hmm. Straight rise. Okay. There's a couple ways to wrap this one, but you can start off like pronation and straight up over the thumb. So here. Yep, mm -hmm. and then you can go like this and then straight from the bottom of the thumb, okay? Then you're going straight up to the knuckle, okay? Now it's it's kind of precarious there, but stay smooth with it and it's gonna feel perfect. Okay. Yes, perfect, perfect. Good, yeah, yeah, good. Nice, nicely done. Yeah. Back there through here. Yeah. Yes. Here. Yeah. Back. Yeah. Right up high. Beautiful, like beautiful. Okay. Yeah. Good. Good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Very and nice. now would be just a thumb. Okay. Yeah. So like this. Yes. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. And then start open a little nice bit. Nice and open. Nice. Yeah, close the thumb fully. Close it fully. Good. Close that thumb. Yeah, that's it. That's it. And as this exercise gets harder, you don't have to open your thumb quite as much. You can keep it more closed and just work closed. Good. Very good. Very good. Yeah, that's it. That's nice. Yeah. That's that. You can feel that one. Mm -hmm. That's good. Yeah, that's your top roll. I'll go here. That's it. Good. 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 Yeah. 
Keep that elbow nice and high at the front of the night. That's it. That's it. Good. Open it up. Oh, that's it. Open it up and close it. Good. Close the hand fully. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah, good. So that's one set. Okay. Right? So then you'd, you'd go up and wait a hair. Five, you go through all of those three times? I, I, those ones yes this 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 pulling so yeah so supination rise roll go up okay supination rise roll go up for five five sets five of, sets of all the exercises so you just go just go until you get a little bit of burn i'd say even before that before and like, then you it. don't really want to burn too much okay you don't really want to all right you're not you don't really ever you don't ever really want to train for endurance really got it because you're gonna get, it's about strength and healing. Sure. This is the healing part. Got it. Yeah, you're gonna get a great pump. You will get a little bit of endurance. I just, I get really cautious and I've made this mistake so many times. Like sure. I've, I've done too much work. I, I've, I've, I've shifted myself a little bit away from explosiveness. You want explosiveness. Got it. You, so if you, you don't wanna to go too heavy here. This is not heavy, it's not, we're not trying to prove anything, it's just blood no, flow. This is not, this is something different. Okay. This is this is kind of maintenance of your tissues. Got it. They're gonna heal better if you give them a pump a little so bit. So if now granted, we're saying for me potentially right now, split it up. If you were to run this, you would do all this together. Yeah. So you do cupping and then all of all of these three moves together. Oh yeah. Look at one. look at I could I would potentially run this entire circuit all at once. Got it. Yeah, and I'd make it like, you know. So uh, you'd go cupping right into this. Yeah, you could. And then start at the top and go six times. You could do all the exercises back to back to back. And then now is there more on top? Yeah. Okay, what's next? There's pressing okay. and there's grip. All right, Okay. so let's go, yeah. go press next. Okay. Okay. Okay, so same kind of thing. Okay, like this. Okay, rehab. All right, I'm gonna work through that press. Part of it, you get some core work for sure. Everything ties together, you know. If you get an injury in your in your calf, you're gonna you're gonna feel it. Yeah, you know, it, arm wrestling super heavy forearm, like everything like away from the shoulder, like you know, down from the shoulder yeah. is, is of maximum importance. Like normally that's where the failure pieces are, but yeah, it's a full body thing for sure, you know? And my left is just waking up again. Yeah, it's, yeah. no, it's awesome. Yeah. Well, you haven't trained it for what, no. seven, six years? Six seven years, years. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay, so then, uh, you know, from here, I'm gonna do my grip. Okay, so I'm gonna put these two exercises together. They don't flow together quite as harmoniously, but just, we're gonna do it. Okay, and here, okay, with grip, I'll do, I'll do a bit more, okay? Normally I'll do like 100. Okay. Because the grip is always working. You're always just working your grip a little bit when you're in the setup. You know, it's, it's good, it's a great tie-in. And you could even split it so you're just doing grip back and forth. Grip, 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 grip. You yeah. Um, yeah, move it around. So this is how I train my grip in arm wrestling. Makes sense. You know. And look at there's tons of different handles. Find yep. your favorite handle and that's what you can work with. Uh, lots of companies, some you can make them. Yeah. I made all my own handles before, you know. Yeah. Yeah. But it's all simple stuff. Really, the multi spinner, the belt. Uh, maybe you can get one that gets right in on your fingers. Yeah. You know, uh, play with all of them. Play with all of them. And this is my basic rehab. You know, these exercises that we've done. So the the, the multi spinner, high low, belt work, rising, press, grip. This is going to cover like 95% of the things you need to rehab. Got it. You could do more. You absolutely could. But. Uh, that, that's a lot. Yes. Yeah, how's that feel? Yeah. Nice. Perfect. Yeah. Yeah. 
Uh, you can get right behind it. Yeah. So yeah, step back you a little can. bit. Yeah. Does it feel all right? Does it feel normal? Yeah. Yeah. You never want anything ever to hurt. Okay. If it hurts, that's obviously not what you want to do. Should feel natural. Should feel good. Yeah. I don't like it. Good. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 Get right behind it. Yeah. Good. Good. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Good. Nice. Good. Yeah. And, and this is going to be a freaking joke for you. <laughs> okay. Yeah, but, but 100, I mean, you know, again, build up with a 50 listen, to 100. This could be just crazy for you. Yeah. Like when you start doing your 1RM work like this, without just straight up, just drag, that's yeah. going to be frightening. Okay. Yeah. Now, now does this angle... It's fine. It's okay? Yeah, it's fine. Just don't, don't worry. Like, that's okay. That's totally fine. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Am I, am I worried about the wrist with this? Or it's just you no. can add the wrist, for sure. And you know what else you can do? You can add a little bicep. Yeah. So put a little upward. You can, you can, yeah, a little bit up. You can add the, you can add the wrist, but really it's the hand that's moving. Okay. Yeah, you're really just pumping that grip. Okay, you can for sure add wrist. You can for sure add bicep, but really this, this, this one is about the hand pump. So that's just try to do beautiful. Here. There you sure. go. Yeah. Yeah, fully open, fully closed. Yeah. Yeah. So I, I can see, you know, if you. Put some weight on there and pump yeah. back that. Yeah, yeah, that would yeah. Be wild. Yeah, yeah. It's all this stuff, all these little motions, like for for high high reps, you know, back and forth. You're gonna get a ridiculous, ridiculous forearm pump. And the thing is, with this kind of exercise, you can do it all the time. Yeah. Like, like the forearm heals so quick. Uh, you know, you can basically be doing rehab exercise type of things like all through the day, and you're just gonna get super. And believe it or not, you will get strong by working even at this rep range in arm wrestling. Got it. You, the arm is just gonna get super healthy. Um, I started doing this kind of stuff like back in like 2000 and like 12, 12 or 13. Uh -huh. And I had this match with Andre Pushkar. Uh, he's dead now, but he was world champ at the time. Uh, and I had really hurt my right arm and I discovered this type of training. Yeah. And for months, I was trying to rehab my right. Whatever my left did, whatever my right did, my left did. Yeah. And for like three months, I probably didn't lift a weight more than 25 pounds. And I went into that match just... So just doing work like this? Yeah. Wow. And I went into that match so healthy and, and fucking strong. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's wild. Yeah, you can do it. Like, so how, I mean, how often would you attack this? I'm Multiple doing times this, per day. Yeah. Like okay. three or four, three times a day probably. Yeah. yeah. But the the other lifts you're attacking like that Same as well. Same thing. Yeah. So this yeah. would follow that. It'd follow. So you'd get 20 some minutes of work here. Those lifts take you what? Depending. Same kind of thing. So you're going 22 about 40. and 22, about 45 minutes. Got it. So yeah. you've got rest periods there. Rest. This is a little bit less rest. Less rest. And just work through it. Work through it. Keep it healthy, man. Yeah. That's awesome. I mean, yeah. there, here's the thing. There's a lot, there's a lot to this game. For sure, without a doubt, right? But it, it, like anything, what I would say is it comes down to work, right? What work are you willing to put in to separate yourself? And, you know, the, the, I would say, and you can tell me if I'm wrong, that you can't hide from the work, right? Yeah. So it's, it's like you could, you could say and you could talk a big game all day, but if you're behind closed doors, you are just simply putting in the work, it will show up. 100%. Right. That's, that's, you know, I always believe that what determines your performance is your homework. You know, what do you do when no one's watching? Absolutely. You know, yeah. if you've done, if you've outworked your opponent in a smart way. Yeah. It's, yeah. It's done. Well, it, this, it's a thing, the, the interesting thing to, you know, coming from a strongman background is that that mentality, right? You, you're saying like at a certain point you're very quiet potentially and or building up the opponent a little bit like mm -hmm. this type of thing right and and I would I would always do stuff like this where I would save not post about some of my biggest lifts right, right? like the, the level that I was at was insane mm -hmm. but I never told anybody right right it was all quiet yeah and then I would save it and at certain points yeah hey here's a little tease of this yeah but 
you know, you may not know that happened six weeks ago, right? right? But it was like, hey, I've, I've been quiet for six weeks now. I'm just going to put it out it's there. It's very disciplined of you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, it's the, the thing is, but then it plays a mental game. It does. Because then it's like, well, if you're competing against me, you're like, oh, you, I just saw Brian lift this rock up, mm-hmm. right? Yeah. Well, I better bump my training up. But you don't know, I'm already, that was six weeks ago. You're, I'm already, you're already, you're already yeah. resting. Yes. You're already in your yeah. taper. So now you're, you're, it's mentally playing a game. Yeah. It's like a mental warfare, right, mm-hmm. to a certain extent, and this is competition. But you, the simple fact is, you can't hide from that hard work, right? No. Like, you can't, you can't get away from it. So. I couldn't imagine. I couldn't imagine just somehow showing up and just being better just by wishing it. No, just no. Just by wishing it to be so. Well, some guys, some guys talk big and whatever, but, like, when the rubber meets the road, if you put the work in, it'll show up. Yeah. You know, so. Yeah. I love it, man. This is, this is super fun learning man i am learning i'm learning from the best right here you know this guy just coming in and and, uh putting on a clinic in the gym here i'm so appreciative of Devin coming in i hope you guys are enjoying this content and uh you know give him some love good guy really really good guy and and has helped me out tremendously here so um, we're gonna keep rocking i'm gonna take some of these tools i'm gonna put the pieces together i'm gonna start putting them into action yes In silence, in silence, that's it. Doesn't always have to be in front of the camera, so. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate it, brother. Yeah. 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 Nothing but love, man. Hope you guys are doing amazing. Appreciate you guys, love you guys. Go out and be great. We'll check you guys later.